we really have to go back to this music. You know what? Three, I'm gonna. <laughs> I'm gonna get somebody to mod you the, the switch, the stream setup switch. And get like custom music on it. Okay. So game one. Finally jumping into the game. Oh, game one is starting on town and city. Right now it has devolved into respective 1v1s. A really, really big stage like that. That is like bound to happen at some point. Zamba trying to get a down smash off of uh, the fact that Pink Doc went for a grab, but was a little bit too slow in his execution. Really nice up there, just to anti air the Zamba right now. Pink Doc is doing a great job of folding corner, knowing that, like, just about anything that he has can kill Ralphie at 120%. Um, I love the early teleport from uh, WAF because, you know, it just like completely put himself into safety. And he gets a down B kill. Okay, that's fine. I would have expected something less committal, like a back air, but he went for the down B. I think just maybe had like a little bit more option coverage since it is a bigger hitboxes. So it could cover more options in instances of drift. Pink Doc, please don't up bail your teammate. Thank you. That's all, buddy. That's, that's, <laughs> yeah, you definitely want to avoid doing something like that. Mm, I don't know about that down B. I don't know what he was going for there at all. He's looking to get something started on Ralphie, perhaps just a backfield to throw him off stage. To be off stage against Dr. Mario, it is so scary because you could lose your stock at 30%. Such a good use of the cape though, knowing the exact timing of Crash Bomber and just making sure that he's not going to get hit by it. It's like that little slight optimization to your play that just helps so much in making sure you can keep up the pace and like not take any extra damage where you shouldn't be. Uh, such a good down B, just catching Zamba, dropping his shield. This is a very, very nice lead for King Ark and Pink Duck right now. King Ark opting for a super, super slow recovery, going really, really deep just to wait out Zamba, getting the Metal Blade into the double back air. Well, King Ark is just holding onto the stock. Ralphie's getting a little bit impatient. You see him fishing for that back air, but then just runs up and up smashes him. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> Such a good back here once again from King Oak. That hitbox is so, so big. I can't believe that back here did not kill. He was so up on the, so, so close to the ceiling there. Oh my god. <laughs> Poor Zamba can't land. Yeah. I swear I heard the spike hitbox come out, though I might have actually been mistaken. <laughs> that knocked the wind out of me. Jesus Christ, I exhaled. Okay, King Oak is smiling and giggling to himself. Pink Dog is, this is, this is some of the cutest shit I've ever seen. Look at them. They're so happy. They're so happy to be teaming with each other. Wait, that, tell me that's not some of the cutest shit. Like them giggling after, you know, they, they, they won the game. I'm so happy. This is the most wholesome thing I've ever seen. They're just having a good time. Like Zombo and Ralby, they look stressed. They look tired. But like King Oak and Pink Dog. They're like, they're like focused, and they're just having a good old time, you know? Oh, he just adjusted his glasses. Oh, oh buddy. That's it. Samba's actually going to be going for Link here instead of Rob. Yeah, I agree with that option. I think with Rob, he was struggling so much um, in terms of landing. Uh, he just like couldn't touch the ground for like such a long time.
really good use of the up air just to keep him juggled, but I don't know how Kengar was able to take on so much percent already. This looks like a very, very different game. I like the use of the up air actually. It's just nice option coverage and forcing the opponent to only approach grounded. And the grounded approach is really covered well with uh, TikTok. I love the conversion of the throw into the back air um, uh, from TikTok and King Hug, TikTok over commits, losing a stop. Jesus Christ, that up tilt. Oh, 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 boy. oh buddy. That was so menacing. I don't know how TikTok lost the stock there. Uh, that's really unfortunate. They're at quite the deficit already. But actually, the stock count is even. Is what I would say if King Ali didn't get up there. Um, yeah, really good for the Zombie Ralphie that they now have a stock lead. King Ali, I like the way that King Ali right now is using his back to maybe try to call out a fall neutral A for the Zamba. Oh my gosh, that Leaf Shield has done so much for King Ugg in the set. It interrupts, it stops aggression, it makes everybody slow down. Um, yeah, really nice. Just wait to take out the stock on Ralphie. He's down to his last stock. Um, you know, Zimbabwe is hanging on to his by a flood right now. He's really smart, choosing to play back a little bit. But because he got the hitbox extended, I don't think he wanted that when he's hitting two opponents at once, and as a result, he, the enemy fell out of it. Yeah, Pink Dog has to take a stock here, but maybe a little bit too late because King Ugg is going to be losing his. You know, and Pink Dog is definitely not... Pink Dog has been prone to comebacks before, and if a kid, I think a character like Dr. Mario can definitely do it. Like, one good edge guard, and suddenly it's even game. Nice use of the jabs, really nice and like non-committal, and knowing that like Link has a sword and just like to be able to still safely space it. Like without having to commit to something as laggy as an F tilt or something. So I love the use of jabs in this uh, game from Zombie right now. Yeah, woo! Bob out to get back to stage. <laughs> Not sure how that was able to happen, but Okay. That was so good. Zombo was like, yeah, I know you're going to try to mash Spot Dodge off out of F-Smash because you think your move is safe and you want to whiff punish us whiff punishing you. But in fact, I'm going to whiff punish you trying to whiff punish us whiff punishing. So nice jab into up smash. Solid. Ralphie positioned himself really well for it. Uh, going into game three, I don't know how Zombo lost, I don't know how Pink Duck, excuse me, lost his stock so early. Uh, I think it was just an SD. He has to be a little bit more attentive of that. So for game three, they have opted to go for a stage, a stage by the name of the FD. Um, not entirely sure about the reasoning behind it. I don't really know when it comes to double sets, honestly. Um, especially when you have four radically different characters, such as these. Nice use of the explosive flames that are actually just calling out King Ugg, kind of pressing buttons on shield. Um, and then just to be able to get like really good damage and convert off of it. I think they're doing a good job of focusing King Ugg, like understanding like his like job is like the utility to be able to pass on and ping and like ping pong onto Pink Dog. She's a second time to a suit. Um, and so by focusing him, getting rid of him early, Pink Dog is like sort of struggling to be able to uh, you know find like a lot of his skill setups. Uh, just like that, they're up two stocks. They have really, really nice stuff. Um, good red team there. 
beautiful waiting for him picked up. Knowing that Zamba was expecting him to land on the shield. He waited for the up beyond the shield and then was just able to whip punch him brilliantly. Um, Zamba's at 132% picked up, trying to get an up B kill, going through the high recovery, but going to be called out for it. He still should have. Wow, that up B had enough. Your pitch is still so surprising to me. Oh my gosh, what is happening? They're literally being put through the blender. They're being spun by Pink Dog's up B. They're uh, Pink Dog's down B by Link's up B. Uh uh. King Hug, wow. Okay. This kind of. I mean, I don't even know what to say here. They're really. They're up three stocks right now. Zomba's stock tank really well. But that up B was untackable. Wow. There's nothing he could have done there. He just had to hold that. Oh my gosh, almost getting the early kill on King Ugg once again. Now this game has completely snowballed out of favor of Pink Duck and King Ugg. Uh, Zamba and Valfi, their focus this game is amazing. The way that they were able to target them at the same time was genuinely phenomenal. Yeah, they got sauced. They got kind of sauced and tossed a little bit. I don't want to say they got bodied, but like, they kind of, they were kind of cooked a little bit. Also, I don't, is it best of five? Yeah, it's best of five. Doubles best of five? I didn't yeah. know that. Xenosaga for just doubles finals is all best of five, huh. and then singles probably top eight best of five. I completely forgot about that. Yeah. See, we don't completely hate best of five, just on the week on weekdays. Yeah. Okay. I guess so. Uh, I guess that's um, fair after all. So yeah, they did a good job of fighting Rob, but they just need to know. I don't know. I don't think they have like a really good game plan against Link right now. Link is just, you know, Zamba is getting so many kills. His reactions to people hitting the shields, or his people crossing him up, are really fantastic. <sighs> Excuse me. So good of me to yawn into the microphone. Look at this. The dynamic completely changed. Now Zamba and Ralph are the ones giggling to themselves. And King Ark and Pink Doc have like, have like furrowing their brows, looking super serious right now. What a, what a defensive way to open up. Zamba opting just to grab Bomb immediately, and then um, Ralphie really smart just to protect him with auto radical. Nice reverse uh, ledge trap from uh, Ralphie there, just to able to come up aggressively with neutral air, uh, catching the mistake on the platform with these up airs. Nice air dodge away from Pink Dog, but he's still gonna find himself getting mixed in for a little bit of damage. Whoa, what a commitment from King Oak. I really, I think he definitely deserves to take the stock there. I think because Zamba didn't tech that, he was able to live. Because he got the bounce. If he tech that, he might have pineappled on the PS2. Okay, that interaction is silly to me. And King Oak and Pink Dog have dropped their lead. And now they are down two stocks once again. Uh, nice up out of shield though, catching the get up attack. Uh, they have to be a little bit more attentive of that, I guess. But then it's like, when you have Dr. Mario sitting in shield, like, there's so many options that he could do at a given moment. It's so scary. And once again, Pink Dog lost his stock so early. Nice down air from King Dog, able to take the stock, but Pink Dog has to be so careful. Okay, Zamba is just recovering really high, waiting for Ralphie. He doesn't mind taking damage. He's Link. He's quite heavy. He's just waiting for Ralphie to come in and help him and get the pressure off of him. So I like that idea, honestly. I like it a lot. Nice use of the... Ah, uh, he tried to jump onto the... Onto, um, up the... 
but really, really sad that he didn't get it. Yeah, this is kind of looking like game right now. King Oak is stuck at ledge. Nice neutral air. Oh, they just completely neutral it into auto radical into up tilt. So much good damage. Nice F smash just to be able to get the pressure off of him. Yeah, being stuck on a corner against Palu is so scary. He wasn't. He was. That was ridiculous. He got. He committed to up B, missed, and then jumped onto King Oak's up B and got another up B. Um, so I'm no longer going to be by myself. Life up, is suddenly bro? a little bit more. I don't know. I guess eventful. <laughs> How are you doing today? 